hello 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 guys welcome back to my channel again hope you are doing good all peoples so today we are going to watch again the Jalandhar street foods okay there is street foods there are like buffets and unlimited items and all we are going to watch it again and uh, we will check whether it's affordable or not affordable how about the cleanliness how about the servings is in the proper way or not let's dig into video not waste time Let's watch it. So basically, this is 149 dirhams unlimited buffet, and there are like 32 items. So let's see the items what they have. Chinese item, Manchurian. तंदूरी सोया चाप और इसकी so before it was the noodles and this is soya chum so basically veg all you look you are a very tasty thing lag rahi hai ye bhi unlimited sir basically 150 dirham roza aur menu sir roz change hota rehta hai apna chaap ho gayi do tarah ke ab jo mere bhai shaukeen hai na chaap khane ke unke bhai mauj hone wale hai kyunki do tarah ke yahan pe chaap aur ye sir butter chicken jaise khao lagta hai na wah bhai paneer ki item bhi aa gayi hai 150 rupaye ke andar कढ़ाई पनीर की रंगत चेक करो कितनी कमाल है बहुत ही बढ़िया भाई ये आ गया मटर मशरूम पंजाब में इसको भाई खुबा मटर भी कहते हैं ना खुबा मटर भी और आइटम देख लो यार अभी काफ़ी सारे आइटम में दिखा दिया अभी और आइटम्स पड़ी हैं पंजाबियों की प्यारी दाल मखनी इसके बिना हर ढाबा हर बफे रहता है जी अधूरा हुआ ये जी फ्राइड जीरा राइस और बड़ी कमाल की रंगत है चावलों की ये आ गया जी मिक्स रायता अगर किसी को भाई जीरा राइस नहीं खाने तो प्लेन राइस भी यहाँ पर मिल जाएंगे भाई देखो ये दोनों चीजें ना सेम लग रही है पर है अलग अलग पनीर के बाद हमने मिस किया भाई मशरूम तो अब देखो यहाँ पे कंफ्यूजन है क्योंकि जगह है अपने पास सिर्फ एक अब अपने पास बचा दाल और मशरूम दाल और मशरूम में मैं दाल को पकड़ूंगा क्योंकि भाई दाल बहुत जरूरी है बढ़िया सो बेसिकली वी हैव सीन द 140 बक्स अनलिमिटेड बुफे लॉट ऑफ वैरायटीज 150 बक्स या अनलिमिटेड बुफे यू कैन एंजॉय इट वीकली वन टाइम सो फूड वाज ग्रेट एवरीथिंग लुक्स ग्रेट देयर प्रॉपर प्लेट्स टिश्यूज एंड स्पून्स एंड ऑल Now we are going to watch another video, which is 160 uh, 160 bucks buffet. So let's see what it is. So as you see in the start of the video, food waste charge hundred rupees. So who is going to waste the food? They will charge hundred rupees to them. <laughs> Great idea. So let's go into the video. Now she is working in a walk and all. It's get dirty, but literally they should be having some water sec section to clean it immediately. It's too dirty. Look at the beside sink. And this owner is commenting that I'm showing the kitchen because we don't do any wrong things here. What is the hell is this? Look at the Chinese wok brush. The sink. He's going to use oof, 160 the uh, 160 bucks buffet. I don't recommend people to go there. Ah, ji wah. So, yar, neat and clean. Samne kitchen hai. Baaki aap aage dekho pizza dikha. Neat and clean. Surroundings look neat and clean, but what is the inside? Each section has mess. Look at the floor and everything. And example, pizza sections. Where is the safety cylinders? There is no any safety over there. They are using the gas cylinders, 
and there is no fire extinguisher. तातवा को कैसे लगते हैं? ये आगे जी पिज़्ज़ा पास्ता सॉस बढ़िया से पिज़्ज़ा पे फैलाई जा रही है, सर है? So we are going to see the buffet now. One sixty bucks buffet. What they are doing it here? Unlimited. यहाँ पे black plate है. शुरुआत करते पहले item से. यहाँ पे ना भाई surprise है. ऊपर नाम नहीं लिखे हुए. बड़ा बड़ा लिखा है food wastage चार सौ रुपए. ये आओ पहला संदूक खोलते हो भाई. इसमें है chow mein. बढ़िया बढ़िया noodles हैं. Beautiful noodles. इसमें मोटे मोटे noodles हैं. इसको डालते हैं. Good. अब इतने बब. Whoever is eating these noodles, God save him. Because we see the people, the dirty and the sink. Please, आपको दिखा रही हैं आप मेरे भाइयों को भी पता है कि भाई plate कैसे बनानी है. पर जो भी नए नए भाई आएंगे अपने channel पे, उनको दिखाते हैं भाई देखो कैसे बनती है plate. ये जी अब आगे इधर देखो. Plate में बाल नहीं. Manchurian balls. Manchurian. इसको लेते हैं ऐसे और ये जो noodles का हमने base बनाया ना, इसके ऊपर आएगा ऐसे. बढ़िया अब ये नेक्स्ट चीज़ जो आई है ना वो आई है भाई पेंट सॉस पेंट सॉस आइटम ज़्यादा हैं स्पेस कम है तो उसको हल्का सा ना मुसाइड पे डाल आजकल तंदूरी जो चाप है बहुत पसंद की जा रही है बहुत लोग इसके दीवाने हैं पफेज में मिलनी है मुश्किल है क्योंकि मार्केट में भाई कितने की होती है फुल प्लेट काम तो एक सौ साठ सत्तर रुपए की भाई कह रहा है कि प्लेट आती है फुल बट यहाँ पे एक सौ साठ सत्तर में मिल रही है अनलिमिटेड मतलब खा के लेट जाओ वाह भाई ये आए एकदम गोरे चिट्टे एकदम खिले खिले राइट ओह ये यार दाल दाल मक्खनी दाल मक्खनी ने कैमरे के लिए भाई स्पेशल डल लाइए कि वैसे डाल देते हो ये स्पेशल नहीं डली भाई ये है ये यहाँ पे क्रीम देखो ना कि कैमरे के लिए आपने डलवा दी भाई क्रीम और डाल दो ये बढ़िया सी दाल पास्ता भी आ गया नूडल भी आ गए मंचूरियन भी आ गए चाम भी आ गए पर ये ऐसे भुक्कड़ भी आते हैं कि सारा एक ही बार में डाल रहे हैं अच्छा तो पाजी का कहना है जो मेरे जैसे आ रहे हैं ना एक ही बार में भर लो भाई लपेट लो उनके लिए लिखवाया लपेटो नहीं आराम आराम से खाओ मेरे को तो सब दिखाना है तो मैं लपेट रहा हूँ ये है जी पनीर पाजी सुनना ले मैं आपको सुनता हूँ यही पैसे पूरे करूँ इस पर भाई टूट पड़ना जितना टूट सकता है पर यहाँ पे अजीब है वैसे नॉर्मल बफेज में हम बोलते हैं पनीर खाओ पैसे पूरे करो पर यहाँ पे भाई चाम खा लो चाम सो बेसिकली गाइस वी हैव सीन अ 150 बक्स बुफे तो क्लीन एरिया एंड एवरीथिंग एंड ऑल बिल्स लाइक आई डोंट नो हाउ इस द किचन आई डिंट सी दैट बट 160 बक्स बुफे अनलिमिटेड इस द even they are showing in the camera, they are not even to like face to hide it and all. Still, it's like, madam. Even though the food, uh, what was the quantity and quality, you can just tweak it unlimited quality. As per looking at the pictures, it quality looks good, but the place, it's uh, where the it's made, it's not uh, good. And basically, this one is in Jalandhar Street Food. People, if you are really eating street food, please check the environment. Please check the people who are making their food. Where it's not possible sometimes to go to kitchen backside and watch what is happening. We are going to eat it from here only. But still, just don't take a risk of doing this kind of thing. If the food is good, okay, fine. Eat it one time. That's it. Not like regular basis, please. So we are seeing the two unlimited buffets uh, videos and uh, look at there and look at this uh, mega kitchen, India's mega kitchen. Brilliantly made technologies, everything is used, and not for hundred, not for two hundred. It's for fifty thousand students from KG to college. 50,000 students every day breakfast lunch dinner three items every day it's prepared the high quality of meal just two items but still it's for 50,000 people and which lot of nutrition and all this is Kalinga Institute in Bhuneshwar in Orissa very beautifully arranged and everything when the children are coming to the schools, so much like it's a hostel as well, they were going. They are taking an admission. They had been checked medically, healthily, everything. No food, nothing allowed from home. Just everything from inside the institute only. That's it. In institute, 
they are taking care of the nutrition their dietness their fitness everything for the example the people who are interested in sports they are giving a lot of nutrition foods healthy food by taking care of them every day check up everything everything is available is just a small foundation if you are watching my peoples any video go to kalinga institute and if you want to donate you can just go and donate over there i don't have any links for that one you can just go to the google and type this one and might be they will produce the account number details or something you can just go and donate over there but this is really really brilliant let's dig into the video very fastly to look at the mega kitchen and how clean it is how the cooks are clean how they are having the doctors how they are having the uh, food cost controller how they are having the engineers to prepare the machineries properly with solar systems and all how there is um, the doctor even for the nutrition and everything every day everything is checked one daily breakfast lunch dinner let's dig into video wave quickly fish from last year are familiar with the check in ritual so basically this is the admission going on here in another line children passing students are getting check up over here if they have any allergy or uh, any uh, problems because because they are coming from small small villages where there is very difficult to get uh, all the services so here they are checked it properly routinely if they have something they are be treated if they have not have something they are directly attended to the school everything is just free no charges nothing it's just run by a uh, donations and it's run by a uh, all the people's donations the uh, people's uh, who are working the day and so invest something all it's everything there so let's begin with video stop on vacation with a student body that stands at over 25000 children and growing look at the children these are 50000 children that's the university on the side this is the playground brilliant keep record of each children is very necessary with very uh, few staff amongst them are potential olympians national level sports champions budding doctors lawyers artists and achievers they come from some of the poorest and most so the early morning after the prayer it's like morning 6 o'clock they are awake socially disadvantaged tribal communities of india with aspirations to break the cycle of poverty which is So early morning 5 am they are awake for the breakfast because it's total of 50000 people 50000 students are there so they need to start it from 5 o'clock till uh, 7 8 9 o'clock they are finish with this so early breakfast is cornflakes and milk plus snacks and supplement a very healthy food nutrition food I snack uh, not at uh, like a small portion or something. Look at the bowl and look at the portion what they are giving for the. A strict service strategy is essential. Full of bowl. Children are served in batches at three to four separate locations on the campus. Our menu के हिसाब से fix है, जैसे हमारा with meals होता है, जैसे Monday को हम लोग का है dura, with milk, as you. So one day they are giving conflicts with milk, another day conflicts with banana, another conflicts is fixed, but uh, they are changing every day, every day something, something, something. So it's very nutritious and healthy. Tuesday है, आज conflicts और milk है. कल Wednesday है, दूधा के साथ. Rugby is a game of strength. So rugby, football, coco, everything is students are being teach over there. And focus. And Luna shines amongst his teammates. Go! Fire! Hey! We're losing. As he powers across the field, it doesn't look. 
look like this young man hails from one of the most nutritionally deprived communities. So basically we are inside of the kitchen, look at the huge containers, how safety they are using, mask, everything safety procedures are handled, gloves, hairnet. <coughs> so basically this is dal and vegetable, rice. So it's like batch wise, they are using 5000 people's one batch. 6,000 people one batch. They are like three to four batches they complete. <coughs> Number. The cook is divided into several batches. <coughs> the first 10,000 meals are meant for primary school children and the next 10,000 for higher secondary students. So 10,000 plus 10,000 plus 10,000, oh my god. These two batches alone are enough to feed the passengers of nearly 80 Boeing 787 Dreamliners. So 80, 80 Boeing 787 Dreamliners, 80 flights they can feed one time they are preparing this food as lunch. But the kitchen prepares even more. There's 5,000 more meals to cook for the undergraduate and postgraduate students. It's a staggering amount of food that must all be prepared by 12. That gives the kitchen just... So before 12 p.m. they need to finish this one. Because after 12 p.m. the lunch break will start. And then they need to serve. Or they are only having the 3 to 4 hours. Which <coughs> the head chef the kitchen manager they promise that it's enough for them for three hours to finish this kind of work look at the buffet systems which you are not seeing inside some are very costly food but here university is giving free education free food free sports academy everything Look at the safety and cleanness. Just under three hours to complete the cook. Mr. Ishwar is the man in charge of operation. As school He is the director, he is checking each container, each item when it's ready, he just check it by hand. Roman has grown in numbers over the years, so has the kitchen. And twenty vessels of three hundred and eighty liters each to boil rice. There are four boilers fueled by diesel and four LPG, boilers. which generates steam that comes in through dedicated pipelines. Adjoining the kitchen is a massive dining hall, which also doubles up as an assembly hall. The prep begins with a of rice and soaked lentils. Even the raw item, like washing and all, still they are doing it in a gloves, safety gloves and everything. Like every day, today too, there's a lot of grains to go through. Like over 4,000 kilos of rice. That's enough to feed an... So 4,000 kilos rice. An average rural Indian for over 39 years. Rural Indian for over 50, 50 years. years. He can Besides eat that rice, rice. The day's menu contains a lentil-rich curry called dalma. So dalma is basically a same like a dal or a, we call it like a sambar or we call it like a milkatani soup. This is mixed with uh, lots of uh, good uh, vegetables and dal. We cook it very beautifully together, not too spicy, not too salty. A perfect blend with a perfect rice and the uh, consistency is same like a kitchen. is a typical dish of the region made from boiling pre-soaked lentils and vegetables. It's not only protein rich, but also rich in vitamins and minerals, depending on the vegetable of the day. Above all, dalma is traditional food that's comfort for thousands of children. Look at the beautiful children, small, small children, they eat very nicely. 
we wish this kind of stuff uh, when we was younger because we didn't have the uh, such kind of stuff. Later than it started, that meals and all giving in the schools and all. But uh, it's truly amazing. Been living far from their families. Even some of the school students, they are been teach to bring it into the kitchen and teach them how to cleanness everything, how to clean the vegetables, how to cook procedures. They are making them teach as well to how to prepare the food and all. On days like today, nearly 400 kilos so 2,400 kilos of vegetables are clean. These are all students. They have been taught. We call it dignity of labor. Nobody everything. has more than 45 minutes to 15 minutes of duty. On the field, Manga Kini is so within 45 minutes they need to finish almost 2.5 kg of vegetables. 2000, not 2.5, 2500 kgs of vegetables they need to clean and give it. One of the Kalinga Institute's top sports women who is on the Indian national cocoa team. So basically, this is Coco and the another lady who is running already almost. Uh, she is the captain of. Uh, Indian cocoa team and uh, she's just studying in there. This lady off the field, she is part of the volunteer group that transforms the lunch prep. She's <coughs> cooking as soap into a community affair. Each lot of vegetables cut is then taken away to clean thoroughly before it's all added <coughs> to the main curry. So it's washed and added to curry. Look at the spices. Exactly in measurement. Huh? Area, cooks are putting together a mix of spices. Every day same. The masala of the dalma stew. Experienced hands dole out exact quantities of different spices. <coughs> Young taste buds. A little too much, <coughs> and the meal will be unpalatable, especially to the smallest children. With vegetables, another 200 kilograms. It is ready in almost 17 to 19 minutes, depending on the type of vegetable. So 17 to 19 minutes, one vegetable is getting ready in one big vessel. Brilliant. Look at the rice. Mid morning, the cook has progressed rapidly, and the finish line is in plain sight. But even this. So this is the area where the children sit and eat. Almost everything ready. This much space is not enough to accommodate. Kids are eating. Still, there is in line people coming inside. It's like they don't need to wait. They just come eat. You can go out, wash your plates and all, and keep the plates back to your room. They had designated one spoon, one glass, one uh, bowl small, and one plate, which is for them only. They need to take care of that one. These people is quality manager. They are checking the quality of the rice, the quality of the food. They will write the notes whether it's need to be changed or something or what brand quality all kind of things does is quality in charge for the mega kitchen and today he's on one of his routine checks along with nutritionist so basically this lady is doctor nutritionist okay for nutrition and all she is doing and this another guy is a quality manager he's checking the rice quality if they need to change or something everything small small things they are taking care of there's a lot on the line at every single meal with thousands of fueled by now we are going to check the solar system in fact every 
Don't you have me kidding. Uses enough diesel to make nearly three trips to the moon and back. That's a huge amount of fossil fuels to burn. In recent years, the school has made an effort to reduce its carbon footprint. I do that possible method. So this guy is Vendu Panda, he's a nodal officer, he's same like an engineer who is looking all the equipments of solar system and all. Look at the solars. So basically this tank is for the hot water. Hot water which you can use directly to the kitchen to save more gas. In the solar system, look at the drillers. These are checking the air quality. Sorry, air quality. No, it's checking the <coughs> look at the solars. Look at the air bubbles, they are just rotating. Being clean and green isn't just about making a commitment to the environment. So basically this is entire kitchen, the green color. Kitchen and uh, there is uh, opposite so beside that there is the people to sit to eat their food and all. operational tool when it comes to a school with 25,000 students. We look at the waste management. What is the wastage happen? When the children are eating food, it's fall on the floor. They collect it all. Vegetables, skins and all. They use for biogas energy. Which is 50 to 80 percent methane. Every day, nearly 75 cubic meters of So they produce methane energy, gas and everything. Look at the mayhem and a big disaster digester. Sorry, they're not disaster digester. Biogas is sent to the kitchen. So they make biogas ready and it is sent back to the kitchen. How the things are converted, how the Products are converted from waste to the best. Balloon room. And that's not the only thing growing from strength to strength on the campus. As you see, this is the karate. As you see, this is a karate section. All the sports, everything is available there. If you are working, if you are to go in sports quota or something, which you want to present yourself for the national team, and all, they make an opportunity for you to making your training and all everything. Very beautifully made. They have cabinet meeting as well. The founders and the uh, sponsors and all the some kind of sponsors, some kind of uh, project manager and all this together. Every day they have discussions about the quality, about the quantity, about the students, about the marketing, about the everything. Everything is detailedly solved problems. bargaining and all and everything now they purchase rice first the quality is checked and then rice is unloaded they check the quality of rice 50,000 kilos of rice one lot he is checking the quality like with the vegetables these batches undergo a weight check they also go through a physical audit to pass mustard now they are approved to empty the trucks. Quality, we can see that, like they have ordered it, 
So basically, before placing an order, people give samples. So on the basis of samples, they finalize everything. So after finalizing, they order this one. And when the order is reached to them, they are checked by each person. So basically now we have seen the such kind of buffet system which you see in my previous videos and uh, the recent videos buffet system how the kitchen is in disaster and all and it's they are saying we are unlimited unlimited doesn't mind unlimited and all look at this university mega kitchen well arranged all doctors are there food uh, food cost controller is there engineers are there to save you all from all the things and all from up to down from waste from best to give the best for this one so this video if you watch this entire video you will understand the differences between the kitchen how the mega kitchen is made and how the normal kitchen small kitchen they make mess and everything so if you have any doubt or any questions just comment me below down i will love to help and talk to you peoples so please hit like subscribe and share my video to entire people whoever are looking to open a restaurant or looking to go into this field or whatever about the health and our diversity this video is very important to them let them watch my video so please share 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 my video to as as more as people so they can see they can listen to me or uh, if they need any concern and anything they can just put comment down i would love to meet them and i would love to talk to them or something so that's it for today guys okay we are almost uh, we are almost uh, finished with uh, our videos and all so see you soon tomorrow with another new video just take care of yourself take care of the community and thanks for helping me and thanks for pushing my community forward thanks a lot i please hit like subscribe and please 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 share this video to most of the people to get me more subscribers thanks a lot